If you're watching this, chances are that the thumbnail, two ants engaged in a gladiator style fight to the death, was somehow intriguing to you. Ants are everywhere. They live on every continent on Earth except Antarctica, and there are over 12,000 species of ants. The ant population of the world is estimated to be between 1 and 10 quadrillion, meaning that there are around 1 million or more ants for every human living on Earth. The ants that you see in this video are carpenter ants. They're one of the largest species in the United States, and they can grow up to three quarters of an inch. Carpenter ants live in a wide variety of habitats, but in this case, I found them on this cable that runs the length of our house. Typically, you'd expect carpenter ants to be looking for food or for a new place to colonize. That means it's probably a bad sign that I found them on our house. They're an invasive species that will nest inside moist rotting wood. I watched these ants for about three hours and decided that I actually have no idea why they were walking up and down the length of this cable. I followed individual ants that were walking the length of the cable, and when they got to one end, they would just turn around and walk all the way back to the other end. I couldn't find where they were going once they reached each end of the cable, and luckily we never found any ants inside our house, so I don't think that they're looking to colonize here. Carpenter ants establish two types of colonies. Parent colonies, which have up to 2,000 workers and a queen, and satellite colonies, which have lots of workers, but no queen and no larva, meaning that they're not looking to grow their colony. I'm hoping that this is just a satellite colony, or even better, some lost ants in a bad situation. If you've ever wondered why ants follow each other in a line, it's because of the way that they communicate. Ants leave behind pheromones that tell other ants behind them which way to travel. This way, ants can communicate where to find food and how to get back to their colony. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I'll post lots more videos of the things that I find living in our yard.